guy. How you doing? So today's video, we have here the egg sitter. This is a cushion you put on any chair. It fits most chairs. This is not sponsored. I just want to test the limitations on this egg sitter right over here. So this egg sitter has hexagonal shapes. Shaped like a beehive and a bee comb. Here's the box. The thing is, it is shaped like this because it absorbs all your pressure points and distributes it throughout the whole surface area. So if you think of physics, the inertia becomes the centripetal. If this is correct, this egg should not crack whatsoever, all right? So if I sit on this egg right now, it shouldn't break. Is it true? Let's find out, shall we? And let's sit down, just like this. Did it break? <laughs> it broke! So this thing doesn't work after all. Isn't that crazy? Let's try another egg this time, okay? Hopefully this one works. How about let's just jump, okay? Let's jump and put my full weight into this egg, okay? Three, two, one. Oh my gosh! It did a crack! Oh, all right. Let's step it up just a little bit. I'm gonna start from here. I'm gonna run and then try. Here we go. Obviously, there are limitations to what pressure points you can put, but all in all, if you just sit and put all your weight on it, it's not going to crack, that's for sure. So we're gonna take it up a notch, and we're gonna drop things on it, okay? We're gonna start off with this trash can. If I throw this trash can perfectly in the center, it should be okay. Ready? Three, two, one. See, it didn't break until it went to the bottom right here, all right? Let's not use this chair because it keeps falling down. Instead of using just a chair, I got here a toilet that I got from the bathroom. We're gonna put it right here. Put this sitter right there. Eggs, please. Thank you. We're gonna put this here. Let's try that one more time. I'm just gonna just drop it. Three, two, one. It turned out okay. All right, so let's test it out even further. We're gonna change it up a bit. Um, since the dumpster or the trash can was a little bit rough on the surface, we have sandbags. This is pretty heavy, but it's really, really soft. So the weight should be distributed pretty evenly here. So let's drop this. Three, two, one. Wow! Perfect. Perfect. Let's take it up even a bit further, all right? What happens when you put an egg on an egg sitter and then put another egg sitter on top of the egg sitter to cushion both sides, okay? Will that provide cushion all around? Let's try it out. Let's drop it, all right? And then open it. Okay, let's take it up just a little bit more, all right? I have here an ostrich egg. It's a bigger egg. Let's see if an ostrich egg will be okay. We're gonna start from step number one, the simple sit down. Okay, we're good. The ostrich egg is fine, I think. It's fine, all right. Let's do step number two. We, we, we're gonna drop sandbags on it. Let's see if it'll crack, three, two, one. So it didn't crack with the initial hit, but gravity killed the ostrich egg. So let's change this algorithm a little bit, all right? Instead of dropping it on a chair, I feel like it'll make sense to just keep it on the floor. That way it doesn't roll and gravity doesn't kill it. We can just drop this bag and it'll be fine. Is it okay? <laughs> it's stuck! It should be fine. Wait, okay, yes, it is okay. Let's step it up a bit. Let's double it up. 
Take this trash can and see if it cushions it pretty well. Here we go. All right, that's pretty good. All right, everybody, I have this 45 pound weight here. So I'm just gonna just kind of drop this and see what happens here. Three, two, one. Wow. Are you kidding me? Wow. This 45 weight is, are you what? Are you, are you kidding me? I'm just kidding, <laughs> it's a fake weight. <laughs> Come on, like who can do this? Like not even the strongest man can do this. Maybe, but like. Nah. My question is, the ostrich egg, obviously it's stronger and more durable than a regular egg. Let's do the same method with a regular egg. We're gonna put the regular egg on the floor and see what happens. Let's get this video to two likes, please. All right, egg, please. Thank you. Okay, we have this egg here. Let's cover it up like this. Toss this like that. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you think the egg is intact or B, the egg is not intact. The egg is not intact. So I have another method here. Take this egg, and now let's get some duct tape or some tape. We're gonna wrap this egg sitter around the egg. We wrap the egg into this thing. If you don't believe there's an egg in here, if you look close enough, the egg is right over here. So I'm just gonna throw it as far as possible here. Three, two, one, throw! All right, do you think the egg is intact or the egg is not intact? All right, if you said the egg is intact, you are correct. The egg is still intact. Let me just throw this in the wall as hard as I can. Over here, ready and go. Do you think the egg is intact? Or do you think the egg is broken? Let's find out. If you said. <laughs> hey everybody, here are 10 egg sitter hacks you never knew about. You can use an egg sitter as a frisbee. You can use an egg sitter as a pizza. You can use an exeter as a baseball. You can use the exeter as a basketball. You can use the exeter as a soccer ball. Is something out of your reach and you need something to help you with it? Use the exeter to grab what you need. Wow, I got it! Thanks, Exeter! You wanna play baseball with your brother? Well, use that as a mitt! Come on, let's play catch! Alright, ready! <laughs> yeah! Do you need a ninja star? Well, you can use the Exeter. You see that egg right there? That's my target. Let's see if I can get it. Here we go. Yes! Obviously, we're not supposed to use the egg sitter the way we have been using. It's only uh, meant to be sitting on, and it's perfect. Don't get me wrong, it's really, really nice. It feels really, really good. But, like I said in the beginning of the video, we're testing out the limitations of this. So, let's try the opposite way, okay? What if the egg sits on the egg sitter? Is it gonna crack? We're about to find out. All right, I'm dropping in three, two, one. It didn't. All right, guys, let's see if it can survive a 200 centimeter fall. Here we go. Three, two, one, dropping. Oh. Can I survive a 200 meter fall? Three, two, one. Uh. I did. Okay, so what did we learn today in today's video? We learned that this egg sitter um, it's really good. It's uh, don't get me wrong. It's really really nice. It's just really really fun to play with and surprisingly It's still in one piece and uh, I'm just gonna sit down here well, That felt good
Wait, I didn't actually sit on it by itself. It feels really good. Not sponsored. Stay juicy.